Okay, today I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to um, uh, uh, store gas in the winter. Um, the best thing to do is to get the, he the heat. Now, this is um, um, for storing and you can actually make gas last a long time. And all you have to do, okay, if you read in the back here, it says for winter start, for quick winter start, uh, gas line freezing up. Um, but the important note right here, it says do not use, sorry, out of focus, do not use for uh, two cycle. So if you get the red one, you can use it for two cycle. Okay, but this one it says right there, you see, do not use with two cycle engines. But anyway. So what you're gonna do is drop it in here and then go to the gas station and store in the rest of it. Okay. Um, easiest way uh, with these right here. Like right now, I have no gas in here. You notice, see them? There's no gas in there. There's a little bit. And this is what I do every year. Um, I just use the heat and and so far i've been experimenting um sorry it's a little cold out today and this here it's a five gallon jug right here and i just pour the whole heat in there so um the treatment supposed to be for um i forgot maybe the uh, a whole tank depend on the car but you see how it says right here it says for five for 20 gallon of gas okay now this is only five so if you want to save um, money you would do it you know a quarter of it but in my case I actually found it a lot better if you use this um, Sorry, a little cold today and I'm a little shaky. Um, I found it better if you use the whole container. So for five gallon, I put this whole thing in. Um, this is a 12 ounce. And for five gallon, I put that whole thing in. And it actually starts better. It um, safer, uh, it's quicker, everything surprisingly not and it's actually that thing is pretty cheap too and it keeps our, our snow blower because in the winter we use snow blowers um, and our tractors to plow the snow and so far it's doing pretty good uh, and two years I've been experimenting this so um, and it makes uh, the snow blowers and tractors goes a lot better and it also too it keeps the gas in good condition and um, I store like that, believe it or not. This is the gas from last year. Um, and there's still a little bit left. So now I'm just refilling it. But that's what I do every winter. Anyway, I'm going to pause the video. And then I'm going to fill it up and shake it up. Okay. Now remember, you're going to need the 93 or 91 or 93, whichever is available. And using heat. And you have to put heat in, um, like I did before. Um, using that would helps it, um, but you have to have the 93 or 91. Okay, don't try to go cheap because it will defeat the purpose. Um, I know it costs a little bit extra, but it's totally fine. Um, so now we're just pumping that in for five gallons, I guess. Um, other than that, that's about it. Now you have to... Now you have to mix it. So make sure the heat, mix it really well. Um, in the, um, make sure the, the heat mix really well in the, in the, um, in the tank. Um, so now it's five gallons worth of... Um, 
no, 93. So make sure, okay? Make sure 91 or 93. That's my recommendation for using heat with this. Okay? Okay, so now I'm back. And it's pretty much mixed right here. And um, this is this is a tip before I end this video. Um, make sure to release out a little bit. Like, don't tighten too much because this will bubble up if it sits if it sits outside. Um, I store mine outside because um, I don't like it inside too. Um, and plus, sometimes I can smell it because I'm really sensitive. Um, so I store this outside. So make sure the cap. Don't release it. Don't don't let it bubble up because I've seen it bubble up. And then um, um, what you do is like you know how before I actually store I before I took the gas out. If that was a lot, I would have just thrown not throw it out. Um, there's two things that for old gas. One you can use it as um, uh, cleaning because you saw my other videos for cleaning. Um, and funny thing is. The heat actually helps it too. Um, heat actually, it's it's really good. I am surprised that like a lot of people don't use them. Uh, I've seen a lot of people use them, but they're not like like I do. Like I do it so much. I use heat a lot. Um, I actually use heat to clean the engine as well. Um, I put them on like paper towel, and I use that to to clean stuff as well. It, it works like an alcohol. Um, I guess it is alcohol. I didn't really read the ingredients in there, but mostly I think that's what that is. Um, to make sure you can read it yourself, um, there's a there's a there's a cast number on there. Um, you can search that on your own. That, but um, dump the old gas out every winter. Dump the old gas out and put it in your in your car. Uh, use it in your car and then refill it with fresh gas that way you you always have fresh gas in the winter um, That way your lawnmower your tractors and your snow blowers always um, in working and start easier um, So that's my tip to you for storing winter gas But like this right here would last us about maybe a few storms and then we would have to do it again But when you do it again, make sure to put um, the heat in. Um, I should have just used halfway, but I don't care. Um, but I could have used halfway of the five gallons, and then another five gallon would be ten gallons instead. Although they recommend it, if you look at it, it says twenty. But if you've seen the other videos, it actually mixed pretty well with the gas. With the gas, so I'm not too worried about that. Um, but the heat for this heat here, the yellow one. The heat yellow um, is for like uh, two and up, the two cycles engine. Don't use, like I said before, don't use that on the two cycle engine. Um, but for the red one, that's for the two cycle engine. And those are like the cheap, you know, small little engines there. But most of ours is over two. So I have to use the yellow heat. So remember that use the yellow heat and then like in case like if you want to dump it in your car you can too because this actually works as a as a, um antifreeze and it'll, it'll remove water too if you mix it uh you, you see videos on that they they mixing heat and it actually uh, mixes pretty well with, with 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 gas so that's my that's my trick for the winter anyway um i hope this video helps and oh by the way too it's cheap too so then you then you would able to save your gas for the whole for the whole winter if you don't use it but like in the summer i would go and dump this into the car and then and then when i need it um to store more gas in um in the in the summer i don't use i don't use heat at all um this is just for the winter but some people i know they use it for for the summer too but i only use it for for, for for winter so remember use heat for winter okay